St. Louis mayor announced his plan to outlaw ARs and AKs and military style weapons. Wait, hold on. AKs are already illegal beyond a certain year. I guess he wants to get rid of all of them. Yeah. So St. Louis, a place that already doesn't enforce existing laws, is passing new laws, uh, hoping that the people who normally don't obey laws anyways are going to start obeying them. So in other words, they're going to take away your means of self-defense and the criminals who aren't going to pay attention to this anyways are still going to have theirs because their serial numbers are shaved off and unregistered. Yeah, guys. St. Louis. Look at that. Oh, you guys are going down to St. Louis. Holy crap. You asked for this. You voted for this. Okay. I know all of you are not criminals in St. Louis. Okay. But you voted for this. You sure voted for this. So you're going to lose your ability to um, protect yourself. There we go. Yeah, St. Louis Mayor... Tishara Jones announced plans to introduce legislation to ban ARs and AKs. The move will make it easier for criminals to blast their way through the city. Yay! <laughs> Jones of the hood rats cheering. <laughs> Jones also wants to ban celebratory gunfire. That's that's already illegal. <laughs> you cannot just pow pow for no reason. Okay? You can't even pull your gun out for no reason. That's called brandishing, which I didn't even know, by the way. Something that is prevalent in, really, is, is prevalent in uh, black neighborhoods. I had no idea. In the city, in New Year's Eve, and other occasions. That's, yeah, that's already illegal. Okay? But you're going to pass more laws. Oh, will have more reasons to take away everyone's GANs. Right? And uh, Mayor Jones wants to take GANs away from those in individuals who are convicted of an insurrection or hate crimes. Oh, that means us, guys. Oh, we're the domestic tees that insurrect, right? Look at that. That's awful. Jones said that legislation would be designed to prohibit military grade weapons on the street city streets. Okay, for, for the for the record, uh, a 223, which is fired by an A an AR-15, is not a military round. It was designed to wound. Okay? Not wipe out. Okay. Go look at the ones that are designed for that. They're massive. They're like they're, yeah, they're way worse. Okay. Prevent the transfer or sale of GANs to kids. Yeah, no shit. That's already a law. Is it not? Take action on military grade GANs, similar, uh, similar untraceable GANs. Also, oh, they're going after ghost GANs. That's this is what they're really after right here. Ghost GANs. They don't want you to print. Thank you, Fredo Ponte. Thank you, three five. By the way, all of the regulars have moved over to to kick. Uh, it the, the the see the letter the green case. It's also it's in the description as well. I'm going to also pin the comment so you can find it. Oh, it's not there. It's gone now. Damn it. Hold on. Copy link address. There you go. Switch to kick. There we go. Yeah, it's um, it's a it's been a better place for me. Uh, and also when you make donations, they only take five percent. So that's great, right? Prepare St. Louis for the passage of Blair's law to ban celebratory gunfire. That should already it's already it's, I mean, first of all, it's a dangerous thing to do. They come back down and hit people. Prohibit anyone convicted of an insurrection or hate crimes from having gangs. Does this count for when black people do hate crimes? You know, like when they when they say white this or white that and hit someone. Are they still allowed to have gangs? I don't think they're going to uh, obey it anyways. Right. And Jones says this push comes in an effort to tackle gang violence. There's no such thing as gang violence. It's only people violence. Okay. The GAN is an inanimate object. It does not operate on its own. I, I understand that Alex Baldwin likes to believe that it does and likes to tell people that it does and it's not his fault, uh, but they, they don't. They, they, they're not living things, okay? Last month, Mayor Jones asked leaked text messages revealed that the mayor was not a true believer in GAN control. In one text message, she told her father, Chicago has strict GAN laws as well, but that doesn't deter GAN violence. Oh, look at that. Dunking on herself, huh? 